All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are live. Men should not forget. It's the topic of the show tonight, ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to welcome everybody to the Stephen Cartwright Show. And uh, here at the Stephen Cartwright Show, we're getting better. Uh, just having trouble putting this platform together, getting everything put together, ladies and gentlemen, but... That's all in the name of progress, uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen. When you're trying to build something and you're trying to do something right, you, you you take the good with the bad. You take the difficult with the easy. So uh, let's get into the show. Uh, let's get into the show tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. You know. Get all this good. Let's get off into it. All right. So get this all here set up, straight set out. Get this looking good. There we go. And uh, men should not forget. So we're going to talk about a few things. Uh, this is the Sunday edition of the Stephen Cartwright Show, ladies and gentlemen. And. Uh, I would like to welcome everybody in. Yeah. Welcome everybody into the show. This is a uh, Yeah, this is a special edition. Yeah. Yes. Get a couple things in, get out of the way so we can get off into the show. Yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's get on off into it. Let's get into it. You know, men should not forget. You know, I want to uh, let everybody know. Uh, I, 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 mainly this, this show is for men. And uh, this show here is to wake a lot of men up. You understand? This show is to wake a lot of men up. You know, don't be walking around here and don't be forgetting. Don't be forgetting. You know, the things that has taken place. Yeah, I want to let everybody know, here we go, uh, uh, hold on just a second, ladies and gentlemen, All right, yeah, right down. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get off into this show here today. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I just want to let everybody know, everybody know up out here is that the, the, the title of the show is 
uh, men should not forget. We shouldn't be forgetting about the things that we have talked about, the things that we have seen, the things that is giving us uh, problems, not only in our community with women, uh, you know, basically with the whole late. You know, uh, you know, all of a sudden I see coming out now, you know, a lot of women politicians coming out to male platforms, you know, because gentlemen, it's time to vote, <laughs> you know, and I got to say, hey, look, you know what, I, I'm not. I'm I'm not I'm not a hyping on this man's name, but he was telling the truth. Liberals don't show up until it's time to vote. And I say to all men, if you're not voting your best interest, you're not voting your community's best interest. You know, because I'm gonna tell you, those women gonna go out there and they're gonna vote whatever they think is best. And see, when we voted behind them this time, look what happened. Everybody know, we, we got bad leadership in this country. And us as men, we ain't got nothing out of the deal, nothing what we asked for, none whatsoever. We ain't got nothing. We ain't got DNA testing. We have nothing in the form of men's rights. We have nothing in the form of even to rights to our children. We have nothing uh, in the form, anything of uniform that is in beneficial to what men want. There is no penalty for paternity fraud. There is no, no we ain't got nothing, man. We ain't got nothing. Why would we go over there and why would we be that stupid and vote for these people? Why would we do that? That means we're going for the same old status quo. They're only showing up when it's time to vote. Gentlemen, is that really fair to us? We get ignored while they busy get everything that they want. That's something everybody need to understand. For real. That's something everybody needs to understand. Is that is that really what we really want? Same old thing still going on, gentlemen. You got these feminists, they coming up. On male platforms, on the men's platforms, and they only showed up when it's time to vote. They blame us for the bad men that is being pushed. Out here in this world today. They blame us for it. That ain't us. That's them. That ain't us. Good afternoon, Ned. That ain't us. Remember, fathers don't really have no fathers don't have no rights to their kids. And I guarantee you, if any one of them was to ever face me out on anybody's on any platform, they'll swear up and down that we do. The only time a man got any type of rights to his children, it have to be overly extreme process of something that the mother has been doing wrong 
I'm sorry, why come we don't have exclusive rights over our sons? That way we can kill the complaining about there's no viable men. But that would make me worry about the women then. It really would. It really would. That would make me worry about them then. Gentlemen, when we go and we sit up in the public place, we a fool if we go back and we continue to vote for the same stuff that has plagued us. We'll be a fool. We'll be a fool if we did that. But which I believe for sure that it's too late. And I want to tell you, gentlemen, I want to tell you, gentlemen, up out here, don't just stop voting. Vote the opposite way. Some of these people don't need to be up there. We need to start looking for, we need to start looking for our best interests. We need to look, cause they're, they're, because they've been doing it for so long. Look what happened to the black community when they started doing that stuff, when they sided with feminism. We're still dealing with it. Was that 60 years later? Damn near 100 years, man. Still dealing with it. Still dealing with it, gentlemen. Still dealing with it. Dealing with the nonsense. Dealing with the things that ain't been nothing but bad for us. Still dealing with it. Still dealing with it. On the real. You know, they're still showing all of these crazy feminists on TV. And that's the thing for them. They love this kind of stuff, uh, 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 ladies and gentlemen. Making these songs about men ain't this. It, it is still going on and on. Still going on. That's why if we don't change up, these women are going to continue to look down up on us as being weak and incompetent. Show a little backbone. Vote against them. Vote against everything that they do. I guarantee you change the tune. Guarantee you they will. Oh, they'll change their tune. I bet you that. I bet you they'll change their tune. I'll put a 100% pure guarantee that they will. They'll quit taking you for granted. Take their jobs or take that power away from them because they have abused it far too long. And look at it, gentlemen. We ain't got nothing. Nothing that we ask for. 
All we got is a bunch of BS rebuttal. And they know it's the right thing to do. It's mandatory you pay child support, but it ain't mandatory for you to DNA test at birth. They lay up there all the time and tell us what to do. What I kids mean, like I told you, you guys, men should not forget. The, the, the men should, the, the, you know, should, should not forget. And, and don't be so damn forgiving. Stop being forgiving. Uh-uh. That's where they could come at you. And they said, well, oh, you know what? I'm going to get away with it. I'm going to get away with it because he's going to forgive me. Ah, uh, you need to keep it yesterday, man. He ain't going to do that. Stop being, stop. Men should stop, should not forget and stop being so forgiving also. Don't be forgiving like that. Uh-uh. It's the biggest mistakes of all mistakes when men start forgiving. I done seen men up out here taking women back. Taking women back after women done cheated on them. The first thing I go, you damn fool. Uh-oh. Whoo. Uh-uh. And you see how the double standard is. Let's just move around. You see how they raise these little old bad kids. These men. That don't understand what it is to be men. And then they can't find viable men that is responsible. Because a woman raised them, then they turn around and blame men anyway. You, you, you know, you, you are, you are not taking responsibility for the product that you made for uh, 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 another man or another woman's daughter. And your daughter fell for the okie doke. Coming straight from the single mother-led household. You can't blame men for that. You can't blame men for that. Fellas. You see, it, 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 it's, we're just having a talk tonight. These are things that we should not forget. Don't be forgetting all of that. These are the things that we shouldn't be forgetting. You don't forget about the hell that you went through with a person. But I say again, Donald Trump was right. Liberals do not show up. So every four years and then you got your vote is screw you. The big fat F and the big fat Y. To you. It, it, it is what it is. Men should be voting their best interests. Men should be voting their best interests. Show should. Men should always be voting their best interests.
We cannot depend on these people to do right by us. They're not going to do it. I see it. Men should not forget what has done transpired over these last several years. No, uh, over these several decades. We should not be forgetting this stuff. Uh-uh. No. If anything, we should learn from the mistakes that we made in that time period. We have to learn from these things, gentlemen. If not, gentlemen, we are going to fall harder next time. And liberal Democrats was planning it. Liberal Democrats. Liberal Democrats wanted to see the black family destroyed and they got what they wanted. Now they are courting black male votes. <laughs> Man, you know what? It's just like You see a pack of dogs walking down the street, walking down the highway, walking down the street, man. And you're on the same side of the road. Are you going to walk right through those dogs and believe that none of them is going to attack you and bite you? Are you going to cross over and get on the other side? Well, nobody, well, nothing over there can bite you. Hypothesizing the scenario. They've already bit us once, gentlemen. They threw us out the house. We've even been to the graveyard. All of these things we should not forget, gentlemen, in this upcoming voting season. Men should be voting their interests. Men should be voting their interests. And if we don't vote our interests, we're going to fail. We sure is. We're going to fail. Ain't nothing going to get fixed. More and more of our sons is going to wind up in prison. And liberals, you know what they do? When you say things like this here, oh, no, it ain't. Oh, no, it ain't. Oh, no, shit. They think you put them. Look. Facts are facts. And besides, if you look at it, don't turn away from the major point. They are hell bent against accountability like mandatory DNA testing. Paternity fraud They hell been against it. They know what it means. I know what it we all know what it means. Hell yeah. You have screwed a person out of thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. And you mean to tell me a person don't have that right to recruit those funds? 
A man don't have that right. Fellas, y'all fall for that? Something wrong with y'all, man. I know I won't. Woman better not deceive me and no kid. I want mine. I want all of it back. And then some. Mm -mm. We cannot, as men, we, 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 we can't just, we can't do that. We can't do that. that that's, that's ludicrous. We, we go for that. We are asking not only for our own financial destruction, but we won't even know if our own bloodline even exists. We have to understand this. Because they don't care. Because as of this moment, as I speak, they have nothing to lose. They have, they have something to lose, but it's no consequence, so it's really nothing to lose. They have nothing to lose. It's just like that same gentleman. I seen him over there in England. He thought he had three kids by this woman. Wasn't there one of them kids wasn't that man's? I think it was somebody over here. Had, what, five kids married to that woman? Wasn't none of them kids was that man's. We see it all the time, over and over again. And you still want to go along with these people? Men should not forget. Stop forgetting this stuff. Stop falling just because they want to all of a sudden show their face. They're going to forget about everything that's went on. They won't forget about everything that's went on. No. Absolutely not. Why would you do that? Men should not forget. Hell no. Why would you forget anything like that, ladies and gentlemen? Why?
lot of broken homes, a lot of heartbreak. It's all that's left is we ain't got nothing out of it. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take a two-minute recess, and we'll be back in just a moment. Got to be better than that.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Whew. Men should not forget. You know, if it's one thing that uh, I, uh, as a content creator and uh, on the rise of building my own platform, if it's one thing that I want to do, I want to help people. It, it's not just men that I want to help. Man, I want to help women too. See, because if you cannot understand both sides of the spectrum, you're going to continue to make mistakes with the other side. Nothing will never be fixed. Overall and all, I still believe that women should be should not be competing with men for power because I believe everybody have their own lane. Uh and some women is just you know they they don't they, they don't really get it you know but it, it is something out here i would like to be i would like to see and i would like to see it take place over you know like the terms of like the a, a term of an olympic event the olympics event one year all all out all in all, since women, a lot of women out here like competing against men. Don't say it's stupid because I know a lot of men would like that. Let's put together some major events where it's men against the women. On an even playing field. A women against the men on an even playing field. Since they want to compete against men. I guarantee you. It's still going to wind up being unfair. For something that you asked for. I guarantee you it will. It's going to wind up being unfair. Yeah. They'll wind up saying that everything's unfair. But I would love to see something like that would happen. But I know you got so many people up in, in, up in this country, and, and, and they're they too coward to propose something like that. Too cowardly. Bark, 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 bark. You know. Men should not forget. The events that's taken that done taking place. Mm -mm. Absolutely not. Don't forget that. You don't be forgetting that. Mm -mm. Men should not forget none of that. It's been a burden to us. It really has. time you look up there you is man fighting a way that you can overcome men should not forget the hell that we've been through over the past several decades 
Sally Jesse Raphael, Maury Potridge, Phil Donahue, Ricky Lake, Steve Wilkos, Rolanda, Oprah Winfrey, Gail King, all of these people, man. How they just dumped on men for most of the situations that they caused. I'm not going to say that men wouldn't, uh, they didn't have a hand in it because Jerry Spring and Phil Dunn you them, them men too. <laughs> I'll tell you. I'm going to tell you what, uh, people. We better figure out, uh, us as men, we better figure out uh, is we going to keep going through this or not? Because I know one thing, it was better with Donald Trump. There's a lot of things I would love to see abolished. Sure would. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm getting ready to bring this live stream to a close. This is a Sunday, uh, the Sunday edition of the Stephen Cartwright Show. And this is something that I wanted to come on and I wanted to say tonight. All in reference to the show and what's best for the show and what's best for our communities. And I, I believe that we should change our vote as men. We, we should... Stay the course and vote against these people and run them completely out of office. Us as men, we should, we should channel our energies elsewhere. It's over. You know, we should not be sitting up here forgetting and being no dumb dumb because of these people. Even choking homosexuality in our schools, you know these are these are liberals, Pri uh, primarily women because a lot of the women was befriending them. We all know that. Gentlemen, men should not forget. Man, we stop that forgiving too. Forget that. I ain't no. You know. I'm going to show it when it's time to vote. Yeah, right. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for me to bring this live stream to a close. And we love y'all, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, uh, every Saturday, we, are, we will be running shows every Saturday. And I will be trying to put out videos through the week. I'm still working on my platform, uh, trying to get everything running up smooth, up to snuff. You know, trying to keep everything to moving right, ladies and gentlemen. We love y'all. and. Uh, like I say, I thank all of my subscribers uh, 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 and all of my viewers for sticking in there with me, staying with me while this platform be raising is growing and, and, and it's just uh, 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 growing pains is going through it right now, but the Stephen Cartwright show is going to be here. It ain't going nowhere. I'm going to be right here until we get everything figured out. Going to be right here. And we thank you, ladies and gentlemen. We love y'all. And of course, peace out.